Katie Price has branded Ulrika Yonson Haggard as she blasted the star over her recent comments about her latest round of cosmetic surgery. Presenter Ulrika, 53, told how she was horrified by 43-year-old Katie's most recent procedures and suggested the former glamorous model was starving for fame. But Katie didn't take too kindly to the remarks and shared a snap of Ulrika to her Instagram stories, writing, at Ulrika Johnson official before judging me and having a swipe at me take a look at yourself and your career maybe you need to take a leaf out of my book as you look haggard my darling. Katie's scathing response comes after the Swedish-British star revealed exactly what she thought of Katie's plastic surgery in her column for The Sun, titled, Katie Price is not hungry for fame. She's starving. In the article, she suggests that the mom of five's plastic surgery is a relentless quest for youth, adjustment and modification and says she thinks Katie believes that inner peace and contentment can be found under the surgeon's knife. The former Gladiators host also penned of Katie, her constant transformations don't seem to have brought her much happiness because it's been a perpetual cycle since 1998 when she set out on this journey of cosmetic metamorphosis. Ulrika went on to say that she once admired Katie's impressive career, before adding, but now she has, once again, exhibited and paraded publicly her latest plastic surgery, and I can't deny I am quite horrified by the images. As a mom, I also wonder what her children must feel. Ulrika also discussed Katie's plans to film a documentary sharing her knowledge of plastic surgery, with her going on to say that the newly engaged star was starving for fame and appeared to be constantly in pursuit of something. The writer touched on her own breast reduction in 2009, but insisted that her goals in regards to surgery differed from Katie as hers was corrective surgery and added that she has no plans to go under the knife again. Katie recently jetted to Turkey for more cosmetic work, which included a Brazilian butt lift and full-body liposuction as well as multiple procedures on her face. And on Sunday, Katie took to Instagram where she shared a completely unfiltered close-up shot of her face as she flaunted her new set of semi-permanent eyelashes, after undergoing extensive plastic surgery. The ex-glamour model who opted for eye and lip lifts as well as liposuction under her chin, told her followers that she is still healing after having gone under the knife. Katie wrote, Here we go completely unfiltered picture. But anyway look at my gorgeous lashes I got done by Annabelle at Master Lash U, and the good thing is I can wear my own lash range lashes with them too at by Kataya Price. I'm still healing from face surgery too, hashtag ad. Katie has undergone lifting surgery on her eyes, chin and lips to create a more contoured look, in addition to full body liposuction and a Brazilian butt lift. She recently revealed the results of her face surgery on Instagram as she posed with new puppy buddy and sporting a full face of glamorous makeup. Katie told fans that she is still swollen from the procedures she's had done, but was pleased with how they had gone as she modeled her new look. I'm Gim so happy with my face surgery. I'm still swollen but it's been two weeks since surgery. While some fans commented telling Katie they love her new look, others shared their concerns. Some of Katie's followers question whether she is addicted to cosmetic surgery, as others urged her not to get anything else done. Some of Katie's followers question whether she is addicted to cosmetic surgery, as others urged her not to get anything else done. Katie has always spoken openly of the cosmetic work she has had done over the years and was seen addressing such concerns during her appearance on Good Morning Britain earlier this month. 
insisting she is not addicted to surgery, Katie said, it's like a car, you have a mo. If you get a scratch or a dent, you fix it, and that's how I feel with my body. I'm not trying to look younger and I definitely don't want that alien look, when people go over the top and look like freaks. Having surgery isn't fun and games, it is painful and it's irreversible. Everyone's got imperfections, I could go over the top but I don't want to look like a freak. She said, I'm not addicted, but if people want to say I've got body dysmorphia, just say it, even my mom says it, you need to see somebody, you're not normal in the head, are you? I said, mom, if you could have your face done again, you would but you can't because you're terminally ill at the moment, you used to have Botox, this and that. Katie explained that she had wanted to transform herself after being left frustrated over the way she looks, after breaking both of her feet in a freak accident last year. The mom of five sustained life-changing injuries after jumping off a wall while at a theme park during a holiday to Turkey. She was left in a wheelchair for eight months and was forced to endure a six-hour surgery on her feet and ankles, 